Alright, this is B Chan with another dojo training video. This time I got CJ with me. In there. Alright, so we're gonna do this Castlevania fan made fighter. Not exactly sure when it was made, but it's fun as hell. And I should have mentioned this sooner. Um, did you wanna do versus still or did you wanna do co op? Because What's the difference? Um, co op is me and you fight against monsters together. Oh. Let's do versus. Alright, because I was gonna say they, it can get pretty intense. Alright, so... Picture number. I'll be having it. <laughs> Is your mouse in the shot? Is it? <laughs> yeah. Damn it. There we go. <laughs> it, it's appeared on a few of my videos. I'm glad nobody said anything. <laughs> So the girl I'm playing as, Shinoa, was in her own DS game, Order of Ecclesia. She's basically the Amy Lee of the Castlevania world. Like, she's a dead-on ringer and everything. But... I find it funny that the first Castlevania game I've ever played is a fan-made Castlevania game. It, they did a good job. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, I can hit those! Yay! What was that? Stop it! What was that? Oh. serious eyebrows. I'm not sure what Castlevania game he's from. Guess I'll play him. Yeah, I don't know what he does. He has pretty serious eyebrows. <laughs> Uh, she doesn't feel like she does in Toho games. Oh, yeah, she does. Okay. So, uh, unrelated, uh, I saw uh, Kong Skull Island or whatever. Yeah. What were your thoughts on it? Um. <laughs> well. I, mean, I heard about Tom Hiddleston, but. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so you read, you read my post? Yes. Whatever. Yeah, that's really the best. It's just insane. It's. I wish Kong was in it more, but uh. But they kind of played it like uh, the 2014 Godzilla, in that uh. I can't figure out which one I am. Am I the yellow one? Yes. Okay. Uh. You're the one that's winning, actually. Uh, oh really? Yeah. I don't think you realized it, but you have this healing ability that you kept on using. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. Man, I was just autopiloting that shit. <laughs> it's a little embarrassing considering I'm the teacher. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> um, so anyways, uh, they did it kind of like the 14, 2014 Godzilla in that they showed him... But it was, like, just, just enough, I guess. Uh, it, was, it was, it was insane. It's, it's a really bad movie. Like, to be fair, it's fucking terrible. It's, it's blockbuster trash, but it's so great. <laughs> it's so great. <laughs> uh, I loved it. You know what, Ronald McDonald. <laughs> 
that's what I've been feeling about a lot of like older animes I've been watching. Like, oh my god, these are so terrible, but they're so bad. It's look at this asshole. <laughs> He's straight up throwing hamburgers at you. Hey, I can heal too. Yay. The only female belt. <laughs> Loser, that fucking clown. <laughs> the I swear to God, I'm trying to do different moves. He literally only has like two. Uh, it's a joke character. <laughs> I wouldn't expect much from him. Oh wow. Yeah. All he can do is like that weird smoke thing. Um, have you tried pressing up and attack? Oh! Burger! Burger! <laughs> I feel like they got the audio from the Japanese Ron McDonald. I feel like they did. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> that would have been, like, really embarrassing for you. Oh. <laughs> I've, I've had embarrassing moments. Thankfully, none of them on tape. Okay. I'll use your guy. He looks like a captain. Yeah, I don't know where he's from either. I'm on a boat! <laughs> <laughs> What is that? He's a big sword. Oh, great. For those of you who don't know, <laughs> CJ tends to do well with heavy hitters. <laughs> I don't know how, I don't know why, but it's a fact. Well, now that you've built it up, it's gonna be like one more smash. I'm good at stabbing and nothing in here. Oh, yeah. I keep on jumping. Besides, to be fair, I'm I'm using mages, like that's kinda my thing. <laughs> also, Yoko's kinda bullshit, because every time I hit you, I heal. Don't forget up and attack is a thing also. Oh shit! Hey, your sword changed! We're also, like, playing really far away from a tiny screen. <laughs> yeah. Shit. Oh, wow. I barely survived that. <laughs> like, 19 health left. Oh, I'm an idiot. I guess I could have just been looking at this screen the whole time. Eh, either or. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. I'm, like, sitting over here. <sighs> Death? Okay. Oh shit. <laughs> well, just because it's you, I don't need you accidentally stumbling on some, like, OP ass move. Oh shit. <laughs> For a second, I thought I was you and that you were. I was, like, about to fight a boss battle or something. Yeah. Isn't this from the first. Isn't death, like, the first Castlevania or something? He's in every Castlevania. Oh, okay. Uh. <laughs> well, it's the slowest part. There it is. Dude, um... Speaking of death... <laughs> <laughs> speaking of death in video games, um... I was playing The Sims this weekend. Or the Sims 3. And my Sims pet died. And, um, whenever your pet dies from, like, old age in The Sims, death will, like, the Grim Reaper shows up and, uh, he'll, like, tell the dog he's a good boy or something like that and, like, pet him on the head and give him a treat. And then the dog just kind of, like, happily floats to heaven or wherever. 
pretty legit. That's... Oh, fuck! God, rage quit. <laughs> <laughs> Is this because I brought up The Sims? <laughs> <laughs> You weren't supposed to tell anyone that. I have an image. I guess I'll play as the maid. <laughs> Great. I'm going to be hitting a woman. You want to dance? I mean, it's Duke Nukem. Is anybody really surprised? Oh, shit! Ooh, jetpack! I have a jetpack! <laughs> Probably should stop playing with the jetpack. <laughs> to the boss mode room with Elizabeth, I would be terrified of what you would do to people. Lost <laughs> <laughs> uh, my bait. Oh, there it is. It's the werewolf, but it's not like my favorite version of the werewolf. In one of the Castlevania PS1 games, Castlevania Chronicles, you fight the werewolf as a boss. But the thing about it is, once he, like, gets a certain level of health reduced, he gets pissed, like, really pissed, really? and literally starts ripping off the scenery and throwing it at you. Oh my god. <laughs> like, Ugh. it was brutal. Like, he threw all, it was at a clock tower, he threw all the clock numbers at me, I'm thinking, oh good, it's fine, I'm finally safe. No, the asshole rips out the fucking <laughs> handle and starts trying to beat my ass with it. the same oh shit <laughs> the same like arc no matter where he's I at. know guys are fucking pro <laughs> he's on fire. I feel like once you learn how to aim with that one like choppy choppy attack I'd be so fucked character in uh, Castlevania Symphony of the Night after you beat it. Like, at that point, you can literally just, like, run through the game and just, like, heck everything in your way. I don't know who the hell this guy is. Uh, he is in Castlevania Portrait of Ruin and Castlevania Bloodlines on the Genesis. The girl I'm playing as is, like, his best friend. Oh. Actually, in the DS game... It's two player and you can play as both of them. Can you? Can you? Oh, press up and attack. <laughs> An actual move from the Castlevania game. Yeah, I remember I'm a mage and not walk here. Start 
Charlotte, because the whole thing that you're going to be learning today is how to keep people from powering up. Okay. Once you get proficient with this, you'll be able to handle, like, Yukiko users in Persona, because when they're sitting there and charging that fire, you can just kind of slip in real fast and wreck their shit. Because <laughs> it does leave them wide the fuck open. You just gotta know what to look for. I can't figure out who I'm better with. Oh, you did good with the axe armor. Like I said, once you can figure out how to aim that, like, rapid slash that he does, that deals a lot of damage. Fuck! Damn! That was a good hit! fucking killed me. How the hell did that miss? <laughs> Jump in this game is actually a button. Okay, that's like her regular map. That's like just a regular attack. Yeah, you mean with like your stick or whatever, you get like 15 health back. Plus 15? Yeah. Yeah, that's your help. Oh. Sweet. So, you, you did decent with uh, Yoko. Yeah. Sorry, I forgot the name for a second here. Like, once, I think once you ran out of magic is when you kind of started floundering. Is, is that a word? I think that's a word. I'm a little inebriated right now, forgive me. <laughs> <laughs> Drunk as fuck! Yeah, you know what, that's actually advice that I got, like, on my second video. Like, I, had a, I have a friend who watches a lot of them, and he was like, yeah, here's some advice for you. Get drunk first. And I was like, are you serious? He was like, yeah. I can't say he wasn't wrong. <laughs> Okay, that one, she either creates, like, she either has the power of ice or she's, like, a really badass swordswoman with teleportation. I can't remember which. Check it out. 
Okay, yeah, she's the swordswoman. Her story is sad, the one you're playing as. Her and her sister got abducted by a vampire and they got turned. figured it out yet, the, uh, hold down the forward and attack thing from, like, Persona and Skullgirls and all that, it's in this also. Fuck! Okay. So you can hit fast. And the bitch laughs. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> and she has a pretty dress. <laughs> well, you gotta bring that shit up, huh? Because <laughs> it's a pretty dress. It's a good dress, okay? <laughs> All right. Maria, Alucard's love interest. Ah. I think... Like, I don't- I'm not sure if the feelings are mutual or not. I know she controls the power of the Saint Beasts. Or if she controls, like, a lot of sacred animals. Or some crap like that. She's... I saw what you were going for, it just didn't work. Yeah. Uh, I'm popping my ankle. <laughs> okay. Um, your heavy punch, I believe, with will uh, cycle through those. And that's your up and attack. Okay. So you have a bunch of different ones. Oh shit, I didn't even know she could do that. she could fly. I mean, I knew she could fly, I just yeah. didn't know it was in this game. <laughs> I didn't either. Yeah, Shinna was awesome. She's like a utility maid. She steals the powers from like other monsters and kind of adopts them as her own. Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
though she fucking fly. <laughs> Don't ask me to tell you how I figured it out. Oh, cool. I don't know exactly what purpose it would serve, but... For South Park game, which if you haven't played it, I would recommend it. That game is funny as hell. Is it? <laughs> yeah, you can throw yellow snowballs at the enemies. <laughs> <laughs> Reminds me of uh, what is it? Uh, in Primal Rage. Uh, oh, um, Chaos. Yeah, Chaos. His uh, golden shower yeah. fatality. I believe they actually kept it in the Genesis version. They kept it in the Genesis version, but they got rid of it in the uh, Super Nintendo, I think. Or no, not the... Uh, was it the Super Nintendo? I think it was. The SNES? Mm -hmm. Pretty sure. Because it definitely wasn't like the N64. No, that was that was still during the 16 to 32-bit era. Yeah. Man, yeah, my thumbs are tired. Yeah, I was going to say, let's take a break. Yeah. All right, well, we'll be back in a little bit. Sai 